Good evening. This is the Christ Cathedral Academy's 2022 Christmas program. I'm Mr. Jamius, or Mr. J, and I'm happy to present this another drive through Christmas program. I'm very proud of all the kids and students that came together to put this on. And even though it was a little weird, singing and practicing Christmas songs in October, I know their hard work has paid off very well. Um, I'm very proud of everyone and special thank you to all the staff and faculty for helping to put this together and of course the parents and I'd like to wish a very happy holidays and Merry Christmas. Over 2,000 years ago, God sent the angel Gabriel to Nazareth, a town in Galilee, to a virgin named Mary who is pledged to be married to a carpenter named Joseph. Greetings, Mary. You are highly favored, and the Lord is with you. What do you want? Why do you come to see me? Don't be afraid. You have found favor with God and will conceive and give birth to a son. You will call him Jesus. How is that possible? I'm not married to any man. The Holy Spirit will come upon you, and the Holy One to be born will be called the Son of God. I will serve the Lord. May his will be done. Joseph, Mary's betrothed, found out that Mary had been pregnant before they came together. Because he loved her, yet believed she had been unfaithful, he decided to divorce her quietly so she would not be in disgrace. But before he could, an angel of the Lord appeared to him in a dream. Joseph, do not be afraid to take Mary as your wife. Her child was conceived from the Holy Spirit. She will give birth to a son, and you are to name him Jesus, because he will save his people from their sins. I must find Mary and make her my wife. In those days, Caesar Augustus issued a decree that a census should be taken of the entire Roman world. Everyone was required to go to their hometown to register. So Joseph took Mary, who was great with child, on the hard journey to Bethlehem. Wow, what a journey Mary and Joseph are on. Wow, it must have been so tough for Mary. Well, let's keep watching and see what happens next. Here comes Fifth Grade to sing the song, O oh, Little, little town, town of Bethlehem. Bethlehem. Oh, little town. to stay.
What do you want? My wife's about to give birth and we need a place to stay. There are no rooms left. Can't you see how proud the city is? Please help us. I need a warm place to have my child. There is a stable nearby. Stay there. How can the Son of God be born in a dirty stable? It's okay, Mary. The Lord will provide and you and the baby will be out of the cold. Thank you. Have you ever been out of town and not had a place to stay? That must have been really scary. I'm glad they found a place to stay, though. They sure are brave. Now let's watch fourth grade as they sing, What, what Child Is This? this? firstborn, a son. She wrapped him in cloths and placed him in a manger because there was no guest room available for them. I will call him Jesus, just as the angel told him. He is the promised Messiah, the Son of God. The show is really getting good, isn't it? Yes, it is. Here's, here's kindergarten with Rockabye Jesus. Go kindergarten. <laughs> Thank you. 
shepherds living out in the fields nearby, keeping watch over their flocks at night. An angel of the Lord appeared to them, and the glory of the Lord shone around them, and they were terrified. Let's hear about those shepherds that night. Here's sixth grade with while the shepherds watched their flocks. <laughs> Thank you guys. Who are you? What do you want? Go away. Do not be afraid. I bring you good news that will cause great joy to all the people. Today in the town of David, a Savior has been born to you. He is the Messiah, the Lord. This will be a sign to you. You will find a baby wrapped in cloth and lying in a manger. What? The Messiah we have waited for has come? Suddenly, a great company of heavenly hosts appeared with the angel, praising God and saying, Glory to God in the highest heaven and on earth peace to those on whom his favor rests. Could you imagine having an angel appear out of nowhere to share such happy news? No, I wish I was there. Let's watch third grade sing Angels We Have Heard On High. <laughs>
let's go to Bethlehem to see this thing that has happened, which the Lord has told us about. So the shepherds hurried off and found Mary and Joseph, and the baby who lay in the manger. We are humble to look upon our Savior. Thank you, and may God bless you. Let's listen to first grade sing the first Noel. men from the east. Where is the one who has been born king of the Jews? We saw a star when it rose and have come to worship him. King Herod heard about the wise men and the baby who was called king of the Jews and was disturbed. He called the wise men secretly to him. Go and search carefully for the child. As soon as you find him, report to me so that I too may go and worship him. King Herod had no intention of worshiping the baby. Jealousy and fear lived in his heart. But the wise men went on their way and followed the star they had seen until it stopped over the place where the child was. They saw the child with their mother Mary, and they bowed down and worshiped him. I'm really him. enjoying this beautiful story, and I hope you are too. Here comes seventh grade to sing, We Three Kings. <laughs>
We are wise men, astrologers from the east, guided by a bright star to find your child and bring in gifts. I have brought the gift of gold. I have brought the child the gift of frankincense. I have brought the child the gift of myrrh. Thank you for these gifts. May the Lord bless you and keep you safe on your journeys. King Herod told us to return to him and let him know where your child was. But we were warned in a dream not to go back to him. We will return to our country by another route. This was the first Christmas. After the wise men had gone, an angel of the Lord appeared to Joseph in a dream and told him to escape to Egypt. There, the Holy Family lived until King Herod was gone, and then they went to live in a town called Nazareth. Jesus grew in wisdom and stature and in favor with God and man. He was the Son of God, born to save his people by bearing their sins. Glory to God and joy to all. This sure was a wonderful first Christmas. It sure was. Let's listen to second grade sing Silent Night. <laughs>
commandments. Now let's listen to preschool to wrap up the evening and send us off with some Christmas joy. Thank you for coming. <laughs>
Weren't they amazing? Oh my goodness, they are the cutest. There is so much talent throughout our school. It was just such a beautiful evening to see all your kids shine. You know that I believe they shine every single day and it is my honor to be their leader and their principal. And so from the bottom of my heart, I wish you all a very Merry Christmas. Thank you again for coming and have a wonderful night and a wonderful Christmas holiday. Thank you.